what say you to your boy Blaziken04 here and welcome to our, my new series on the channel welcome to which Pokemon is better and I hope you guys did enjoy that that review we I did yesterday because you if you liked it because I'm gonna do another one tomorrow tomorrow we'll be doing we'll be watching the top five I mean the top 10 hardest Super Mario 3D World levels made by Nathaniel Bandy and if you want to go check him out right now I'll put his channel in the link in the description below but anyway guys today's con today we'll be looking at Ferrothorn Cartana but before we start we'll be looking at stats we already know both typings so I'll show them off now they're weak against fire and caught weakness to fire and weak and also and weak to fighting resistant to dragon electric fairy normal psychic rock steel water and and super resistant to grass and it means the poison type. Now before we start we'll be looking at most of these. Anyway guys, roll the intro. Okay, the first Pokemon we'll be looking at right now is Ferrothorn. Ferrothorn is the first ever grass steel type Pokemon. Like I said, it has nine two weaknesses eight nine resistances and a mean to poison fair thorn is currently in ovies as you see right here it has this is his hazard setter it's much more on the defensive let's look at his stats first it has okay hp good enough attack to do damage being respectable attack set of 94 great defense stat of physical defense of 131 and special defense of 116 well, yes, it's not towards the spe fit special attack side, and speed suck being at base 20. It's much more of a bulky Pokemon which can take hits and set up hazard. Literally, it got spikes and stealth rocks. If you see this OU set right here, it has spikes, stealth rocks, Leech Seep, Howard Whip, and even a choice of knockoff, protect, or gyro ball for stab damage for gyro ball. And how about this? And this thing even seen playing Uber. It's supposed to go with the Uber set. And Uber is much more than defensive Pokemon since so many Pokemon can take it out. Since a few Pokemon can take it out, it's better off just being defensive. So you see right here, you have Protect, Spikes, Leech Seed, and your choice of attacking me just in case someone want to taunt you. Gyro Bomb Power will obsess in case someone want to taunt you because if you don't. You're pretty much gonna struggle. But anyway, doubles is where Fairy Thorn does well. It even does well. See right here, we have we have, a, we have one set with a tanky private with gyro ball, power lit, leech seat, and protect just in, just to protect yourself. Iron ball is mainly the prime ability and leftovers just for recovery. And I also forgot about the EVs. Put it each. They mainly put HP a bit to attack defense and more on the special defense since they do a little bit more. And how about the Battle Spot Singles? Um, Battle Spot Singles is much more of a support Pokemon with the, with the items not not only got LFOs, you, like, you also got an option of Rocky Helmet. And you see the EVs right here, you got much more HP a bit to attack and much more on the defense side to be a much. And his nature is relaxed or sassy right here. Alright, so Gyro Ball is the first move. Stealth Rocks right here. Leech Seed and Protect. Protect just to protect yourself. Power Power Whip just in case you want to grasp that move. And Bullet Seed because why not go for Bullet Seed? And that's next is VGC 2018. We have two choices for Ferrothorn. Like you said, it's much more on the defensive side with the Gyro Ball, Power Whip, Leech Seed, and Protect. Leftovers for recovery, iron bar just to take hit to make sure physical attackers contact moves and put HP to his HP EVs should be on his HP attack defense and, and mostly a special defense and and you can even give it a choice band set they even gave it a choice band set yes a choice band. You got Gyro Ball, Power Whip, Knock Off, Bulldoze, and Iron Hand, just in case you want another stat move. And EVs are HP, Attack, and Special Defense. So, this is a pretty decent set. 
It's basically giving it Bulldoze to help with that terrible speed, but you're not gonna be able to speed Pokemon though. Thanks to its base 20 speed. And and last but not least, mono type. This is the only mono type you know, the grass type. But this is an all all around setup move that is a gyro ball with Leech Seed Protect, Gyro Ball, and Spikes. Items are leftovers and EVs are HP, 68 for defense, and 188 for special defense, and no IVs. And you got one last set being a utility sports support for the steel typing. Power Whip, Leech Seed Protect, Spikes, Spikes to put up Spikes and self rights just in case you which one you want. And Knock Up just to get rid of Evil Lighters like Evil Light Chansey and Porygon 2. And leftovers of Rocky Helmet are good. And yeah, that's pretty much it, guys. Ferrothorn is much on the bulkier side. <clears throat> Having moves like Leech Seed, Spikes, and Stealth Rocks, which is so common in the game, but not in doubles. Because if you see right here on doubles, entry hours aren't that nearly as common besides from Leech Seed. And if you see his VGC 2018 set. You'll see that Leech Seed is the best option since Stealth Rocks and Boodles, since you might mainly do not switch out. So the Leech Seed is pretty useless, guys. So, but overall, Ferrothorn's a really great defensive Pokemon. Most of his set mainly focus on two, two to three setup moves and one attacking move. The reason you want to give it an attacking move because if someone goes to Taunt, Ferrothorn's pretty much screwed. So, next up is Kartana, guys. Next up, we got the still the second grass still type Pokemon Carton. First is stats. It got an HP stat, HP step of base 59, an incredible attack step of 180, good enough defense stat of 130, but a terrible special stat, especially a special defense that make a powerful special stat Pokemon like even if it resists attack. The special stat is still pretty bad. Unless you put EVs, EVs to its HP stat, that thing probably will die to almost every single special attack move. But luckily, have a good enough attack speed stat to do damage. Let's look at this paper sword stance set. You mainly want to give it sword stance, then just just leaf blades and sacred sword, and defog, defog just to get rid of entry hazard, smart steering for steel stab damage and knock up to get rid of. You should give it the jolly nature, guys. A EVs will be HP for four. Special attacking speed will mainly be your option. We have a second paper paper plane set with a choice scarf set, and like I said, the same nature will be jolly, guys. Leaf blade, sacred sword, smart steering, knock off, D fucking knock off. To me, you better. This is a better set. Leaf blade, sacred sword, smart steering, knock off. D the problem with D fuck. Because you're pretty much stuck in one move, especially if the Pokemon has Shadow Tag. By the way, the EB Beast Boost's main ability will raise his attack stat, guys. And EBs will be HP, special attack and speed, like all, like the same. Anyway, let's go to VGC 27 doubles first, then we'll go to the both VGC. Right here is an all around attacker with. With the with the flying of steel Leon or grassy Z with fleet blade smart steering sacred smart sleep blade smart steering or sacred sword tell when to boost your boost your team's speed sacred sword for another like sacred sword just in case and knock off to get rid of items and protect because protect and mainly what I do right here is put adamant nature which raises your attack and loads your special attack. Put EVs to your H36 to HP, 248 to attack, 112 to def special defense, and 112 to its speed. All right. Next is the battle sp spot singles. You have we have two sets running a sword stance set and a choice scarf set. Sword stance right here. You want to set up a sword stance. You have so many options right here. That's how crazy Carton is pretty dang good at what it does. Yeah, the Fighting MZ, Darkium, Grassium, Normiums, and Focus Stats. Like we said, for most of them, Jolly Nature is the best. Swords Dance, Leap Blade, Sacred Sword, and the four of them. Smart Steering for Steel Stab Damage, Knock Off, Get Rid of Items, Nice Last to Take Out take out Psychic Types, Psycho Cut to Take Out Fighting Time, and Giga Impact just in case you want to take them out together. Alright, and put EVs to a attack defense and speed 
as for Toy Scarf, Leap Blade. Right here you have Leap Blade, Sacred Sword, Smart Stir, and a choice of Knockoff, Psycho Cut, and just in case you want to go for the wrist, Golden Tin for the one hit KO, man. Choice Scarf and Jolly Nature, like always, and put Eevee's towards attack, defense, and speed. And last but next is V. We'll start with VG 2017. Carton is here because it is our regional dex Pokemon, so it's lucky to be there. And I think, ain't, I think Cartonis ends in, but it really needs to worry about those fine moves from the likes of Garchomp and others, because there are a bunch of other Pokemon that does run Flamethrower. You can put out, <clears throat> you can find out all the Sass Attacker with Leap Blaze, my Steering, Second Store, and Detect. Focus Sass with items since so many Pokemon will just kill it with a Fire type move. And Jolly Nature for always with Special Attack. For, for, for special defense and special defense and speed and you can even put a risky for the assault vest which will raise the special defense but remember a few Pokemon can still one hit KO with guys Leap Blaze, Smart Steering, Sacred Sword and Night Slash Assault Vest with Beast Boost with Jolly Nature which Jolly Nature will put Eevee's twist then to 8 HP 164 to special defense and 252 to his speed but since we're done with that, VGC 2018 is is still here, and worlds are coming up soon. So let's look at Cartana's few sets right here, because it only got one set for now. It's an all around physical attacker with Leap Blade, Sacred Star, Smart Steel, Light, Tailwind, Smart Steering, and Detect. Focus Stats, Flying M or Grassy MZ, Beast Booth, Jolly Nature, which you, you already know what it is. 4 HP, put EBS to his HP stat, 252, and 252 to his speed stat. Cartana is a beast, but I think what let it down for not showing up in Ubers is that poke so many special type Pokemon will just kill it, even if they resist it. Like Mega Mewtwo Y, Russian Ramp, the list goes on and on and on, guys. But Ferrothorn is better because it's much more bulkier, but we don't know about that. But Ferrothorn likes an attack. But anyway, let's see which one is better, guys. And by far the better one is well, let's look at a little bit before we before I say which one is the better one is. Well, let's look at the overview. You, but we'll only be focusing on OU. Cartana is special defense is mainly what is is what led it down because better Pokemon like Mega Charizard X. Why, or even so many Pokemon with high special attack will just kill it. So yeah, that's what Cartona's let down. Ferrothorn's let down though is this low speed stat that which cripples it. But even then, they don't care about us being Pokemon <clears throat> because it's much more of a fast po. It's much more of just a bulky Pokemon, and it has a set of spikes, Stealth Rocks, and Leech Seeds, which Cartona doesn't have. While yes, Cartona does have Defog. To me, Ferrothorn just adopt better, so I'll get the edge to Ferrothorn. While yes, Ferrothorn stats are much lower than Carton and doesn't have the speed, have making much more bulky Pokemon with spikes, Stealth Frost, and Leech Seed is key to your success. While yes, Carton is an all-around attacking Pokemon, his special defense really let it down. That's why if you bring one in Ubers, you better be lucky to survive one with them. If you guys go deep into a few your videos from a few months ago, you'll see me run a Cartana in Ubers, which did pretty well. But I saw, t but I think there were too many dang special attack Pokemon that just kill it. That means, like I said, Mega Me 2 X rush around. The list goes on and on. That's why Cartana cannot do don't do well in Ubers to me, because too many special attack Pokemon will just kill it. And it's not that. And yes, an OU is one of the most dangerous, attack, the highest attack stat in OU. That, which is really good enough. Special defense, man. Even assault vest to me doesn't really help it out enough because special attack Pokemon can still kill it. Ferrothorn is better because of its better bulk, having active despite stuff from Elite C, even seen playing Ubers, and just does well throughout. Is a great hazard setter along with Skarmory, and is really good at what it does. So, yes. Ferrothorn to me is a better one. Don't get me wrong, Cartana is a really great Pokemon, but its special defense to me really let it down. And 
and if that's really what led down. If it did have actually elite steed, then it can be. Then I could easily give the edge to it. But unfortunately, it doesn't have elite seed. And while yes, it's lumbering pace is like it said, like Smogun said, for our thorns to prepare hazard setter and oh you guys. That's what it says. And it can even do well on Ubers. Let's show you off the Ubers before you conclude the video, guys. What does Ferrothorn does well against? It's immune to toxic, resistant to stealth frogs, have leftovers lead seed and protect, has spikes, stealth frogs. And sure, it has struggle against Pokemon like Ho Oh, my favorite Pokemon, the best Pokemon ever, in my opinion, Blaziken, Primal Groudon, Marshadow, Mega Lucario. But it does. But you always still got Anim and checks like Exernius, Use Belt, or Quasar. I don't know about those. But it does well. It does well. It fits the team. Does well. It just does what it does. That's why, to me, Ferrothorn is better. But anyway, guys, thank you guys for watching this video, guys. If you guys do like it and really do enjoy this series, please go subscribe to my channel. And make sure to get ready. Either later on today or tomorrow, we'll be doing the Nathaniel Bandy top. This thing I said earlier today, guys. Earlier on the video. But anyway, guys, peace out.